Oh, listen to that music. Hood Tastic here. Got a got the first game for you. The interview. Here we go. Join Q. Zero data accident. Zero double zero. Oh, right. Who's that? He's stupid. Ain't nothing in there. Oh, hey! Wow! Do you a job without passion or not at all? All right. I don't know about these signs. I don't know if it's supposed to be motivation or not, but uh, I ain't a fan of it. Hmm. Always be losing when the sea fell. Can you pick that up? Can you put it? Nope. And that dude at the cardboard thing is gone. All right. This is registration. What do you want? Guess I'm going to register. Start here. Okay. I guess so. We got a double yes. Do you agree? All right. Green. What is your work style? Hmm. Processing answers. All right, surprise no. All right, all right. You may proceed to another cave. Okay. I guess I'll go the right way. It's quite difficult to manage. What do you mean? 
He can't keep his hands to himself. Oh, all right. We shut all the door calls except the one that's wrong. See if you can figure that out. So it shows you the material. You accept the channels. I guess so. Good luck, Chump. Well, whatever, dude. Let's go this way. Check all the outside first. We go in. Nothing. A seven. Nothing. Whoa, dude. A seven. Seven, seven, seven. Oh, another one. Two. This guy. Seven, two. Oh. Two? Something dumb gonna happen. I see it coming. It's like it's just, just, it's just too quiet. Oh my gosh! Seven two two zero. Let's see. That's it. Two two seven zero zero two two seven. What? Oh boy. Damn, it was harsh. Very good. I guess I'll take it. All right, dude, my bad. What kind of job would put you in a cave? Oh, wow. Okay. Suspect, but okay. Some dumb happened around the corner. Oh, what?
It got me? Come on now. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, boy. I escaped that wretched place. Thank you for playing. What? Alright. Nice. Cool. Very short game. But. Next game. Uh-oh. <laughs> I just did this game the other night by the same developers. It's gonna get creepy. Let's do it. Game number two. Alright. Let's get your teeth, bro. Your teeth brushed in. All right. Breakfast. Breakfast sounds good. See now on the table. Tomorrow's gonna be a new day. Sounds good. Shower. So far, nothing. I'm not hungry, but should I eat? Uh, probably not if you're not hungry. Okay. Oh, you just keep living the same thing over and over again. I'm most certain that's aggravating. Jeez. That just don't look pleasant at all. Stuck in one place, stuck in one feeling. You don't walk away from this. You'd rather stay like this. It hurts too much to even begin thinking of solution. Stay, cry. Oh shit. Is that me? Oh, that's creepy. Oh my gosh. And that's just creepy all in itself. Look at the details. Clean.
Good lord. There's just gotta be sound effects. It's gotta be. There's something's coming. We in trouble. I draw right there. Woo! Hug the wall. Gamer 101. Hurry up, song's getting loud. Let's go, let's go. Woo! Let's keep it moving, keep it moving, keep it moving. Let's go, let's go. Oh! Just to look, whoa! Just looking back is like, ah! Do you want to do it? No, I ain't looking back. No. No more looking back. No more looking back. Mm. Come on! You know what though? It's looking in the fear of the unknown. Like you don't know what's there. And that's the part that will drive you crazy. Cause like if you know like your girlfriend or Somebody's gonna be there. Good lord. Then you would walk the path. But if you don't know, it, oh shit. Nope, not looking, not looking back. But if you don't know what's at the other end, it's like, Ugh. do you wanna watch, walk that path or not? <gasps> shit. Enough. Final game, memorabilia, WSAD, <gasps> let's get it. Where am I? What happened? Why is it so dark? Ooh, I'm chugging. Looking up is smooth, but... Oh, car keys. Now I remember. We were 
on a trip to my parents. But where's Andy? There's a path. I should see where it leads and hopefully find Andy. Let's do it. What was that? A crow, and I ain't looking back. Oh, our wedding rings. I remember our wedding. It oh. was beautiful. Our we wedding had rings. so much fun. I we remember so our excited. wedding. We couldn't it wait to be married. We had so much fun. When I looked him in the we eyes so and excited. said yes. We couldn't wait that to was be the married. Best moment of my life. When I looked him in the eyes and said yes. That was the best moment of my life. I think the path leads this way, don't it? Yeah. His belt. I remember the first time he hit me with it. Oh. It was a beautiful sunny day, and I was cooking. I was in such a good mood, but he came from work and something wasn't right. I didn't know what. I tried cooking something new that day, but he didn't like it. He shouted and pushed me. I fell, and then he was there over me with the belt in his hands. I couldn't wear a bra for days. He beat you in your chest or in your back? Oh, in your back. I know these flowers. He gave them to me. The day after he beat me up with the belt, he was really sorry. He apologized and cried and apologized some more. I forgave him. Slips happen. It was just once and he would never do that again. Or so I thought. That's foul. One year after we got married, he beat me up. So brutal. He had to take me to the hospital. I had to tell them I fell down the stairs. Totally cliche, but they believed it. Look, man. You can get some shit like that, you leave, man. What was that? I know that's hard, but you gotta tell your friends or just leave everything behind and just leave, man. Ain't no man supposed to do nothing like that. After I got home from the hospital, he bought me these earrings. He apologized so many times. He even took days off work to take care of me. Whatever. He promised it would be the last time. I believed it. You didn't love him. You feared him so much you're scared to run. Hello? Andy, is that you? I ain't looking back. It was fuck I took these pills yesterday. Last week I went to the doctor and told him I couldn't sleep, so he prescribed me these sleeping pills. Fortunately, or unfortunately, Andy came home from work earlier than expected. He found me and made me vomit. After that, he told me we would visit my parents today as planned, and I shouldn't tell them because they would think it was their fault. He promised that everything would be better. That he would never, ever hurt me again. Who said that? Uh, it's time for you to choose. It's now time for you to choose. You can take the left path when you will wake up from your coma as if nothing happened, a miracle, so to say, but Andy will never be found. You will have to live your life without him, or you can take the right path, which leads you to deeper into the forest to search for him. If you ever find him, you'll be together forever. I know I did you a lot of harm, but I'm sorry, really. I would never do any of that again, but please... Don't leave me here alone. I know. You don't know shit and fuck you. 
before I even continue, look, man. It's. I can't say I understand because I've never seen it happen or never been in that situation myself. But one thing I know no man is supposed to beat on their women. That shit is uncalled for 100%. If you do some shit like that, you need your ass. You won't do that to a dude. Your size, height, name. Man, look. I got a sister. Cousins. Let it happen. I'm 325 pounds, 6 foot 3. I dare it happen. But we gonna leave this motherfucker in the, in the dark. But for the game... I am going to go back and go to the right side and see what happens. In a coma. You lost your damn mind. All right, we're back. Um, we are going to take the right turn and find this piece of trash and see what happens. I'm only doing this for the game because he he don't deserve to be found by anybody. Look at this mess. <laughs> wow. Wow. Uh... I'm done. Thank you for watching. Fantastic. I'm gone.